So we're gonna bring you along to another one of our misadventures because you never know what's gonna happen and you never know what we're up to. So tonight, where are we, hon? We are at the Creole Queen. This ship was christened in 1983. This ship was around for the New Orleans World's Fair, a legendary event here in the city of New Orleans. The city that we've come to know and love was defined by this World's Fair and this is something that represents that World's Fair and my love, personally, of my city. Because I was actually able to go to that World's Fair in 1984. Let me tell you guys, I remember things vividly. We had a gondola. We even had a monorail. I think that's why I love Disney so much. Because we had a monorail here in New Orleans that went through the convention center that started over here at Spanish Plaza. My first time ever being on a riverboat, a paddle boat, was this ship as well. So for me, this means everything. And as you hear jazz music in the background, let me not forget to tell you, this is part of why we love New Orleans, because you never quite know what you'll hear over there. And we hear a jazz second line. And the second line is coming up right over oh, here. We actually are going to see a second line. And a lot of our videos, we tell you this, you never know what's going to happen when you're walking down the streets of New Orleans. You but don't. guess what? We're about to go on this jazz dinner cruise tonight. And guess what's coming? A New Orleans Jazz second line. So let's go check it out before we board the ship. And we're going to tell you a little bit more about this later. By the way, one of the reasons you come and do this because you get some of the greatest shots of being on the river. And you only get these shots if you're on a ferry, cruise boat, or something of that sort. It's Ethan. breathtaking, and I truly breathtaking. Guys, we highly recommend if you've never been to New Orleans or you have, definitely do a jazz cruise. 
because you're gonna have the time of your life. It's so relaxing, you get to see the beauty of our city. And one of my favorite views is the GNO Bridge, the Greater of New Orleans Bridge. Now we're going into the dining room. We asked about handicapped services before and what's really cool is there is a chairlift that brings you to the third floor in the dining room here. I'm literally, we're looking at someone doing it now. I'm not going to show them out of respect for them, but this is just awesome that there's a function that they have on this paddle boat. That is so cool. saving the food review for you guys because there's so much food up there that I'm definitely going back for more. Also, we wanted to mention too, it's beautiful in here. Also, the jazz music is awesome. The environment is just absolutely beautiful and relaxing. We started mentioning earlier that we were celebrating our second year anniversary on the Creole Queen, but then we got cut off and distracted because of course the second line was going past us. Aaron and I, we got married February 19th of 2022. So last year when we started our channel, we were filming Mardi Gras parades on our first year anniversary, which we love because we love Mardi Gras, we love our city, we love the culture, we love everything about it. So we decided we were gonna celebrate and go to Disney after Mardi Gras was over and we did that. This year Mardi Gras was earlier. So we finished filming earlier, but we were so tired because as you know, if you checked out our channel for Mardi Gras, we did so many parades, so many events, and we were just tired. We are planning on going to Disney very soon, but we are celebrating our second year wedding anniversary on the Creole Queen because we love our city and there's no better place to celebrate our wedding anniversary than here. So we're gonna thank the Creole Queen for inviting us out. We thank you for our second year wedding anniversary jazz dinner cruise. We're excited to show you some really, really good food, some great times, and the beautiful scenery of our city, and just a beautiful night out on the Mississippi River. So let's go have fun. Got the Caesar salad, some green beans, some rolls, some green beans. We got some fish here. Some jambalaya, some chicken alfredo, some baked chicken, some brisket, barbecue brisket, some mashed potatoes, red beans and rice here, and some gumbo. And for dessert, a little bread pudding for you. We cannot wait to try this food. I guarantee it's gonna be amazing. Cause it's New Orleans, the food everywhere is amazing. So what did you get, man? I got a little bit of everything. Some jambalaya, some of the pasta some of the roast here, some potatoes, some fish, some chicken, and some gumbo. My wife, I thought was gonna have red beans, so I gotta get where I can get red beans, but, and then salad up there. So there's two more things I'm anticipating. What's cool about this is, a lot of this stuff is New Orleans style. So you got jambalaya, you got gumbo over here. They also have red beans and rice as well. I cannot wait to dig into all this. Let's give the pasta a shot. You have to come to New Orleans and of course get New Orleans traditional food. And here they have it at the Creole Queen. This pasta is so good. On to the jambalaya. Mm -hmm. 
the tomato sauce based jambalaya. So good. It's my personal favorite style of jambalaya, which is tomato sauce based, because that's what I grew up with. But there's other ways to make it too, and they're all delicious. Now on to the potatoes. These, these mashed potatoes are great. They're great. Mm. That's the die for. Time for a little roast. Ooh. And what's awesome is they have roast, they have chicken there. Yeah, it's like a barbecue beef roast, and it's really, really good. Also, we wanted to mention that water is included with the dinner, but if you want soft drinks or you want alcohol, you do have to pay for that, and that's not included. Everything so far is really good. When you come on these river boats or steam boats, paddle, or wheels. paddle wheels, there's all different kind of boats here in New Orleans. They all have really good food. Every time we've been on these river cruises, including the Creole Queen, we've never had a bad time. We've always had an amazing time. The food was always good. So we highly suggest when you come to New Orleans, please splurge and do a dinner cruise on the Mississippi River. Or you can do a brunch. They also have brunches. So remember, whatever's easier for you, if you want to go morning, if you're more a brunch person, if you're more a lunch or dinner person, we're going to link all the information below. So when you come to New Orleans, you can see, you know, which one's the right fit for you, which cruise. So now I'm going to try their gumbo. It's chicken and sausage. Most of the cruises do a lot of chicken and sausage because I guess it's more neutral for everybody. Not everyone eats seafood. But if you go to these restaurants here in the city, a lot of them have seafood in their gumbo. So just remember that. So you can get both. And sometimes they give you multiple options. Mm. Yeah, with the okra, it gives the taste a little different flavor. It's actually good because sometimes you can get gumbos here in New Orleans and a lot of times they're all different. And this is a perfect example of a, a different gumbo with a different taste. So I like it. I would get that again. I like trying different gumbos. I'm hooked on gumbo. If you see a lot of our videos that we went out to eat, the first thing I go towards is gumbo, chicken and sausage of course, and jambalaya. So that was really good. The guys going around here and one of the things we do before you get on the boat is take a picture. And these are our pictures you can see here. And so with that, after you are seated and eating, or if you're upstairs, they actually come around the area with the pictures to show you and see if you want to buy them. You don't have to buy immediately. They'll allow you to wait till you get off the boat or get near that time. So you could decide, do you really want your picture or not? But look at us. I'm just falling in love with her all over again. Now remember guys, you only have one time to take the picture. Yes. So as I mentioned, if you don't like your picture, they that can't retake it. It's only when you're boarding the boat. It's a one-shot deal. That's a river boat. Oh boy, that's huge. <laughs> yeah, anybody ever saw the gambler, Kenny Rogers? It kind of makes you think of those type of ships. And in this case, I'm gonna know when to fold them. So guys, we're with here, we're here with our friends that were congratulating us on our two-year anniversary. How are you guys Congratulations. Doing? Congratulations! So you guys are from Florida, huh? Yeah, so we're here for a sales conference with kids. Nice. Disco Senior Living. We, we run senior living communities in Florida, of course. Lots of seniors. Wow. But I was born here. This is my hometown. Is so. it really? 
I was born in New Orleans. Grew up in Slidell. Okay, so. So I'm back home. Yes. So happy two year anniversary to my baby girl. Aw, happy two year anniversary, baby. Yes, yes, yes. And I find more ways to fall in love with her every day. Aww. But speaking of two year anniversaries, we're about to come up on our two year anniversary of our YouTube channel. Yes, we are. Our first video was April 30th, 2022. Yeah, like I said, basically May. And so, you know, we're coming up on those two years very soon. Yeah. And hey, it's been a journey. It has. For those who want to know why we call ourselves the Misadventures, it's really simple because you never know what we may be getting into next. Honestly, I'm completely honest, we get these opportunities last minute. They were like, we can't believe it. So we were invited out here for our anniversary to this boat. And it's just another one of those opportunities that we didn't believe in a year and a half we would be getting these opportunities. Never. So, so first of all, before, we normally do this at the end, but I want to do it right now. We want to thank each and every one of you who supported us from day one or to up until now. Thank all of you. Those who subscribe, those who have not subscribed, thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you. Because without you, none of this is possible. Thank you to our families. Who supported us, our family and our friends that supported us from day one. You guys know who you are. Thank you for all your love. And you know, we love our city. We love people. We love you. And and we just hope to be our very best every single day for you guys who, who take the time that is so precious to watch um, content that we put out that you may be into. You may not watch everything of ours because everything may not appeal to you. But when you find something that appeals to you, or, you, or the reason you started watching us, you watch it and you give us all your love and support. Thank you guys, truly, from the bottom of our hearts. And hopefully you guys stick around for more of our misadventures. The journey has just started with her and I. It's just the start of the rest of our lives. And now we have almost 20,000 people, or if not more, who are gonna follow along with us through our journeys, through our trials, through our tribulations, through our struggles, through our successes, to our life. So thank you all. We are turned around because we are heading back towards home. We're gonna be showing you the beautiful view of coming back into downtown New Orleans. It's gonna be a breathtaking view. And that's the one thing when you come to New Orleans and you do take a cruise, you have priceless views. Another reason why you have to do a jazz cruise, especially with the Creole Queen. And you're going to get some really good food. <laughs> ah. And you're going to hear some really good jazz music. It's a beautiful night out on the Mississippi River, guys. Also, you see all the ships going by. The ships go by day and night. It never stops. Also, we're going to show you something that used to be a little piece of history. The building with the little spike it looks like at the top used to be the World Trade Center that we have here in New Orleans. The band on here is absolutely amazing. They got they're getting the standing O's and everything because they're killing it up here. It's smooth. It's smooth. It's, smooth. it's uh, it's classic mixed with contemporary jazz. It's just awesome. And shout out to my man Stephen Walker right there. Killing it right there. My baby girl got him on for an interview before. The sound didn't work out on that one, so it's great to see you. <laughs>
<laughs> so we are here with a friend who we had mentioned earlier, Mr. Stephen Walker. He is playing on the Creole Queen tonight along with his amazing band members. Hey guys, you guys are awesome. Thank you. <laughs> so it's good to see you. Yes, it's been a minute. It's yes, been a I know it has been. I think the last time was I think the Creole Tomato Fest that we actually said hi to each other. Yes, yes. So how have you been? I've been fine. Awesome, it's so good to see you. So for those that do not know who you are, tell everyone a little bit about yourself. Uh, well, I'm a local trombone player. Uh, I call myself local, but been all over the world playing. Grew up, born and raised in the city of New Orleans, Louisiana. Stephen Walker. Thank you. He is very talented. You see him at a lot of big events, especially in our city, and as he said, all over. And we're excited to see you here. So we had a great time. You guys did an amazing job. We love listening to you guys perform. Where can we find you on social media for those that want to find out more about you? Um, well, we have a YouTube channel called Swinging in New Orleans. Swinging in New Orleans. Find me on uh, Facebook, Swinging in New Orleans. Uh, YouTube, Swinging in New Orleans. Instagram, Swinging in New Orleans. You know. So guys, we're about to dock. Hope you guys enjoyed your time here with us on the Creole Queen. We hope you enjoyed your time with us here on the Creole Queen Jazz Dinner Cruise. Hon, what did you think? The food was amazing, the music is top notch, and the environment, the ambiance, is second to none. So, in other words, we enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Yeah. And the food is very good, and you get the best views of the city. If you want to come here for an anniversary, birthday, any occasion, just because, a, a little date night, this is the perfect place. Or your anniversary. Or your anniversary, like I said before. It is an amazing time. Also, remember there's no elevator. There's also a chairlift that brings you up to the additional floors. We had many first timers on this jazz cruise and we were talking to them and they said they had an awesome time and they would come back again. We would definitely come back again. So thank you to the Creole Queen. We love you. So with that said, we hope you enjoyed our tour, our dinner cruise, our jazz dinner cruise on the Creole Queen, showing you the beautiful city of New Orleans. So with that said, les les bons sons roulés. Let the good times roll. Good night, guys. We love you. Thank you for watching. We can't wait to bring you many more events here in New Orleans and many things to do. And stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. Check out right above us is going to be another one of our New Orleans adventures. Have fun with that, and we hope to see you next time.